Hey guys, Wayne here from H2 Tech Videos. Today I want to show you how to reset your LG Aristo 3 back to factory settings. And I'm also going to show you how to back up all your data before you do the reset so that when you get your new phone, you can have all that stuff load on the new phone. So here we go. Let's get started. All right guys, so the first thing you want to do is go to your settings app. And we're gonna make sure we're on the general tab and we're gonna go down to backup and then tap on Google backup. And so what this is gonna do is it's gonna back up everything from your app data, call history, contacts, text messages. Um, and it's gonna basically back it up to your Google Drive. So this is one of the reasons why you always sign into a Google account on the Android phone because again, all the apps you download, it saves it. And again, it's gonna be backing up all your other data as well. So um, you're gonna do this backup first and then after this is done, and again, just to show you, it's moving really quickly. So it doesn't take a long time. Now granted, we don't have a ton of information on the phone, so yours may take a little bit longer, but no problem, just go ahead and let it run its course. And after that, um, then we're gonna move on to the next step, which is removing that Google account off of the phone and then doing the actual reset of the phone. And we're almost done. Wait for that little bar to get across there. And our backup is done. So that was super quick. Now we're gonna go back. Quick point, if you are switching to another LG phone or you're basically trying to factory reset this phone then you're gonna set this same phone up again, I would encourage you to do uh, a backup under the LG mobile switch as well. You just hit backup here, hit backup. And um, this also creates a backup uh, again, if you're switching to another LG phone or you're doing it on this phone, it will back up more things than Google does. So I encourage you to do this backup as well. So after we're done with that, we're gonna back all the way out. And now we're gonna go down to accounts. And the main thing you wanna do is tap on your Google account and you wanna remove it. Any and all Google accounts on the phone, you wanna remove it. You always remove it before doing a backup of the, or doing a factory reset. If not, it will give you problems when you try to sign back into the phone. Now the last step, we're gonna to go to restart and reset. And we're gonna tap on factory data reset. And then we're gonna hit reset phone. And then this is the last step, delete all and reset. At this point, it's gonna completely erase everything off of the phone and it's gonna set it up like a brand new phone. So at this point, your reset is done. Don't touch the phone, let it sit and let it fully reset. And you'll know that it's finished because on the last screen, it will ask you to choose a language. So we're not gonna keep the video on so you can see the whole backup. Just let the phone sit. It's gonna restart a couple of times and then you're gonna be all set. So hope you guys did find this helpful. Make sure you like, favorite, and share if it was helpful. Hit that subscribe button and make sure you also check out our new site, Tech Made Easy. On the next screen, there's a green circle. Do us a favor, guys. Show us some love and click on that and subscribe to our new channel. We're trying to build that following there and we have uh, exclusive content that's gonna be on the new site and we don't want you to miss out. So make sure you subscribe to both. Thanks again for watching. Take care and have a good one.